Hello and welcome to the Man Games. Today is a bonus episode. We're going to be looking at five of the worst figures that we have looked through over the past few episodes. Now, this does not include the episode when I showed you my own personal range. These are all based on the um, figures that I said I gave my nephew. Um, so, yeah, the episode where I showed my own personal figures, them figures are included in this video. Um, so today we are going to start off with, at number 5, the John Morrison figure. So yeah, just um, as I said before, um, just think it's a little bit boring, not a lot going on. Um, I mean it's in good condition, um, but yeah, just as the actual figure, it's just a little bit boring, there's not much to it. So yeah, number 5 on the list today is John Morrison. Next up we have a Eddie Guerrero figure, um, so this Eddie Guerrero figure is just Eddie Guerrero's head on a body, um, so there's nothing special about it at all, there's no tattoos, you know, if you cover up the face it could really be anyone. The only reason why this is um, number 4 and not m number 5 is purely because it is Eddie Guerrero, so <laughs> yeah that is Eddie Guerrero, Latina Heat. Um, at number three, we have the Chris Sabin TNA figure. So this was previously on our TNA episode. Um, yeah, the reason why um, this is number three is just don't like the movements of the figure. Um, it's just I just find it a hard figure. You know, if you want to have a match, it just just doesn't move properly. Um, yeah, and. Just don't really like any of the the movements at all, really, of the figure. I just find it really hard to move. As you can see there, the shoulders are quite stiff. So yeah, that is Chris Sabin at number three. Number two, we have the Triple H figure. Um, just because, obviously, this is one of the figures that the same head's been added to different bodies. There is quite a few Triple H figures like this on different, well, with different like attires. This one is the DX version and there's different boots but basically this figure is out there just with different clothing shall we say so yep that is Triple H at number 2 and if you have watched previously I'm sure you can tell who number 1 is it is the Rock figure so this is number 1 for quite a lot of reasons it is hard to move it looks nothing like the Rock there is part of the tattoo missing because um, it's where the arm meets the um, the body there, um, you can give someone a clothesline, that's probably the only decent thing you can do. Like I said in the previous episode, it is in good condition, but that's probably because no one wanted to play with it. So yeah, that is the rock figure. Um, yeah, so that is it for this bonus episode of the five worst figures that we ever looked at over the past few episodes. Please leave a comment, let us know, let me know if you agreed, if there is anyone you think I missed, please... Um, leave in the comments and let me know. Please like this video, subscribe to the channel, check out the other content on the channel, all the 2K20 videos, the Wrestle Crate unboxing, um, there's AEW Universe out there, which is my personal favourite to do on the 2K20 videos. And that is everything from the Man Games today. Thank you, bye.